Nope, I'm Andrew from Wretched. I'm Steven, Steven from Wretched. Great guitar player. We're here at Manfest uh, 2014. We're gonna give you a tour of our vehicle. Uh, come with me, man. Let's, let's, let's check it out. Yeah, well, we weren't expecting this. It's gonna be a little dirty, but uh, it's uh, uh, we're, oh, we're fuck, already, dude, we're over wrong, here. Wrong vehicle. Fuck. So this is our single wide. So this is our yeah. bus. Single wide. We spend uh, seven to nine months out of the year, every year, for like the last four or five years for me. For you guys, like, how long have we had this? We got, we got in 2010, you know, so we've been with this single wide for about uh, four years now, four or five years. Basically, it's it's home. Like I see yeah. this thing when I'm about to go on tour, and I get all nostalgic and yeah. and uh, as as modest as a bus that we have. To get home. But, uh, let's give you a little tour. Right now we have the, uh, the bus tent set up. But today, you know, we we're trying to fit in with all the, uh, you know, all the big buses and stuff, and have our little, you know, a little curtain, you know, little privacy corners. We got our, our shirt here in the window, rolled up in the window, keeps all the sunlight out. We got our little blanket here, so we can, um, we can hang out and talk about things that are. Uh, Business, right. business related stuff. This is this is the pilot area. We don't really let you know the rest of the band come up here. We just yeah. kind of keep this for the pilot. So our driver, captain, captain co-pilot, and then a select few of us are allowed to come up here. But yeah, they basically this is where all the controls are. We got an atlas from 2009. You can never travel anywhere without an atlas because GPS doesn't always work. We're pretty old school too. So. This is a uh, Harold and Robert. They have been in this van since day one, since we got this van. They keep a watch on the van when we're not, you know, in the van. So, anyone comes up, they're there. We got some important necessities here. We got some books, some books. For, for Joel, usually is co-piling in. Got some uh, baking soda. This is for my hair. Me and Joel wash our hair with baking soda, you know, the hippie way. And now, we're on to the uh, hotel living quarters area. where we live and dwell and sleep, you know, the bands. Um, this is Joel's Slipknot shirt. He usually wears this on stage, but uh, for some reason he didn't wear it today. I don't know why. Uh, yeah. What we've been, what we just started doing this tour is we started doing this bed here. We built this, uh, Stephen had a buddy build it. But um, before we used to all have our own rows. And then I think last tour we did, we took out the two back rows and we were sleeping on the floor. But yeah, this time, we were saying like if we're not gonna do a bus, we just decided last minute not to. If we're not gonna do it, we wanna have beds, we'll have a driver, so we can sleep. So we built this and uh, we have Steven there, we have Joel here, I'm here, Adam's there, then we have a, a, uh, a random everyone switches off here. But if you look carefully, I have a Tempur-Pedic mattress that I bring everywhere I go. I have a horrible back and this thing is so clutch. So as far as it being a van, nobody's seen everything, at least I have a fucking Tempur-Pedic. And uh, you can't tour without a rubber chicken. It's just not possible. You cannot do it. Rubber chicken, you must have the rubber chicken. So we're still trying to get used to this setup though. Normally you'll see some dream catchers, probably some tie-dye stuff. Not even kidding, we like always decorate it, but right now, you know, it's a little bit of a mess. We haven't tied it up, but uh, yeah, let's check out. We have the living quarters back here. Speaking of having tied it up, it's gonna be yeah. a horrible mess. But yeah, check out our next living section. Well, normally what we have here is like two bunk beds. Until we did that setup, we were, we would you know just pull over at WalMarts or whatever, long drives, and just camp out back here. But uh. But yeah, now we have that stuff, so this has basically just become storage. We keep our luggage. We all have bikes too, uh, especially for a festival like this, you want to have some transportation. So. Yeah, the we have the whole, the whole fucking band has bikes. We got my dual suspension. And right here, as you can see, this is just the, the chilling area. This is where we hang out. This is, well, usually our gear goes back here, and we'll, when we're playing and half of the gear is out, We'll just set up a nice little hangout area. We got, uh, we got Tony from Victory yes. Records right here. Yeah. We're doing a little tour bus, uh, you know, tour. Yeah. Just showing it out. But, uh, tour great tour for all the bands. Yeah. Yes. So we're just, uh, this is the hangout spot. This is where we just have beers and hang out. Get to watch bikes. 
And then we have a community workout thing right here that Amir's brought, and we just kind of share some weights and we'll work it out. Like you know, every every day, there's it's communal; anyone can use it. So we usually try and park next to them just for that reason. But uh, yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the setup basically. What's up? This is Steven and Andrew from Ratchet. Thanks for checking out our van. Hope you guys had a good time. Have a great time checking out the rest of Mayhem Fest. Yeah, Steven. check us out on Facebook, check us out online, YouTube, videos, just search Wretched, Wretched NC. We just took the knob off of Knob oh. Creek. Yeah, now this is where the party begins. Now I can relax now. and just have some party time. <laughs>